Tonight, an update now to a six fix that we have been covering for months. Diane Yates is one step closer to moving into her new home after she hired a Cameron contractor to renovate her home. He allegedly took $60,000 from her and then never finished the job. Brendan Myers now has three charges against him. But six news reporter Sydney Deshawn has visited the property multiple times and tonight she gives us an update. So Sydney, how is everything looking now? Yeah, Kristen Lindsay, progress is being made and it's being made fast. Diane says she now is planning to live in her home before Thanksgiving. This is all thanks to Otis Foster with TNO services and our six fix coverage. Foster says he typically never turns on the news, but on a random Friday evening, he saw Diane's story. Him and his wife knew they had to help after seeing her living conditions. Flash forward to today, Diane is almost ready to move into her home that she calls a dream. Diane has a deck with steps that she says is perfect for her grandchildren. She also has a sewing room. She expressed appreciation to everyone who has helped in this process, including our news coverage. She says none of this would be possible without Foster and his team who made it their mission to get this home complete. July the 3rd, they actually started working and they haven't even hardly missed a day except Sundays they, when they go to church. But I, every time I tell Otis how much I appreciate all of them, he says, it's God's work, not mine. And I thought I was gonna have to leave Cameron and probably move to an apartment in Temple or something, but my dream is coming true. Now a benefit fundraiser for Diane is being organized for Saturday, November 4th at the Cameron VFW Post. There will be a live auction, mechanical bowl, brisket, and a free bounce house for the kids. If you can't make it, head on over to our website, kcntv.com, to learn how you can help, guys. What an amazing story. I mean, talk about turning something that's criminal yeah. into yes. something that brings the community together. Mm -hmm. They really rallied around her. And the house is looking great. Yeah, it mm -hmm. does. Sydney, thanks so much.